This episode of On The Line is brought to you in part by Flow. Out here in the sea, there are no lines. The ocean opens up herself to everyone. For TNT sailor Andrew Lewis, his job is to conquer the ocean. With winds of adversity blowing him off course and the sails of misfortune against him, we'll tell you this story of Andrew Lewis on his road to Rio. We're on the line. In every sport, there's a line. All athletes put themselves on the line for club and country. Today I'm going to take Robert into my world, show him how it's done in the gym, the fitness side of my life, how I get strong, how I stretch, and how I'm able to do what I do from the strength side of things. And then later on, I'm going to take him into the boat, throw him in the ocean, and really see if this guy can really sail and see how it is to be in my world. Well, I'm ready. Well, I think I'm ready. All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to get your bum on your roller. your hip to thrust the whole time. All about the hip. Right, that's it. Eh? Throw the hip harder. Throw it hard, right, harder. Breathe. Right, on the next one, one time. Only going a handful forward. Right. Ten. <coughs> Three, yeah? So this was a stretch and warm up. We eat now? Yeah, we need some fuel, so absolutely. Good. Like it. This is Mr. Orlando Griffith, my strength and conditioning trainer. Pleasure He's to meet you. He's the guy who's uh, responsible for making me uh, fit again, strong again, and being able to put me in a position where I can actually get back in the boat. How was that all working out for him in this, this whole road to Rio? Um, it's been going really well, Andrew is very hard worker, so it's been kind of easy for me to kind of get things done with him. Um, he participates well, he's asked a lot of questions, he's very involved in what he's doing. And I mean, everything couldn't be done with, without the support of the team that we work with. Mm -hmm. And um, it's, he's ready, he's ready for real. So, we head into the water. All right, cool. <laughs> There's gonna be a long one out in the water. Sun's hot. Sure is, you know, we need that energy. So need that energy. That's what I eat. Hard boiled eggs, for that I had some oatmeal for the energy, protein, oatmeal, protein and uh, oatmeal together. It's a solid day of energy. So I eat. Four thumbs eat. up. We gotta... Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> Right, my muscles are now loose and so is my stomach at this stage. We've had a quick protein snack and now suited up, make our way to the water's edge. 
As Andrew takes the laser out for a quick test of the conditions, I'm on the jetty thinking, how will we both fit in this thing and can my abs take it? Well, I quickly find out. whether I'm glad to be on land right now or whether I want to be back out there but it's it's really deceptive looking at the water here at this stage it looks relatively calm but when you're out there it's quite choppy and it's unbelievable how fast that laser goes it literally is as they say like laser you were able to balance yourself you didn't fall out the boat um, while you're out there going fast which is important because as I told you it's a lot of core and a lot of balance and uh, yes you have the strap there to help you but it takes um, a lot of balance between the whole thing. So yeah, I think you're pretty good. You understood when to lean, when not to lean. Um, you got a little taste of what the ropes do and uh, how they affect the sail and affect the boat and help you power it up and uh, depower it. So yeah, I think you did pretty good. You're pretty good. You, uh, you touched the line. You definitely touched I the touched line. I touched the line. I didn't go on the line, but I touched it. That's important. 